Mission Director hereby authorizes for the launch operation sequence. Real-time programs activated. A textbook lift off as LVM 3 M4, India's largest satellite vehicle, put Chandrayaan 3, India's third exploration mission, into the orbit on the 16th minute after blasting off from Sri Harikota. The Chandrayaan 3 mission aims to achieve a soft landing of the lander Vikram on the moon's southern side. So, the rover Pragyan could explore the moon's surface for key information on human habitable features, minerals, besides other geological and seismological features. The launch has also added a feather in the cap of LVM-3 rocket. Congratulations, India. Chandrayaan-3 has started its journey towards moon. Our dear LVM-3 has already put Chandrayaan-3 craft into the precise orbit around Earth. 170 by 36,500 kilometer was its intended target orbit and it is precisely there now. And let us wish all the best for the Chandrayaan-3 craft to make its further orbit racing maneuvers and travel towards moon in the coming days. So let me wish all the very best to Chandrayaan-3 for its further journey towards moon. It is indeed a moment of glory for India and a moment of destiny for all of us over here at Sri Hari Kota who are a part of the history in making. You would recall Honorable Prime Minister had very recently said sky is not the limit and living by his words I think the Chandrayaan today has gone beyond the limits of sky to discover the unexplored horizons of the universe beyond. In 2019, Chandrayaan 2 that attempted the same succeeded only partially as it crash landed on the moon's surface. The orbiter though sent crucial details. With lessons learned, more than a thousand people, including hundreds of scientists, including Mission Director Mohan Kumar and Satish Dhawan Space Center's Director Raja Rajan, slogged for four years. The lander was made stronger and put to rigorous tests with the rover. The software was made more robust and new algorithm added to handle all possible challenges in landing. There was collaboration from various domain experts to achieve a soft landing. What I am very happy is LVM3 has now become a very successful 100% certified vehicle so that it can, a lot of launches have happened after the Chandrayaan 2. So LVM3 has a very good success, 100% successful rate. So it gives a lot of confidence to go to its Gaganyan mission. India now waits for 23rd August when Chandrayaan 3 is slated to make land on the lunar surface after a 42-day journey. If everything goes well, the moon landing will happen around the last week of August. Scientists are confident that they would make it this time. A successful mission would put India on a global league of a few big countries. Only America, Russia and China have achieved this so far. At the Satish Dhawan Space Centre at Sri Harikota, with Suresh, Sam Daniel, Findy TV.